What's up everyone, this is Autogus Tech, and today I'm going to be showing you this awesome shortcut you can get on your iPhone, and on top of that, I'm going to be showing you a really cool exclusive Siri shortcut in this video as soon as we get started. So the Siri shortcut has absolutely nothing to do with this video, but I just want to let you know that I actually updated iSimplify, where you can get the latest Siri shortcuts and other things like that. And this one I think is especially cool because it's basically a Cydia alternative built inside of a shortcut. So that'll be linked down below in the description if you want to look further into that. So me personally, I like having a minimalistic look on my phone, and I think the first page on your home screen looks awesome if it has a wallpaper where it's completely visible and not covered up by app icons, which is why I love this really cool 3D shortcut. So you're able to press on the application and it gives you really quick toggles to other apps. Now what's different about this tutorial is that there are around four different apps on the App Store that have the exact same feature, which means that you can theoretically have four different apps and on top of that, you can force press and get another four applications. So there is one free one and then there are three paid ones. So the one free one only lets you open up stock applications on the iPhone. The paid one, on the other hand, lets you open up practically any supported icon it has. So I'll be having the free one listed down below as the second link in the description after my website iSimplify. But what's really cool about this is that you can have a really cool minimalistic look on your iPhone with the apps that you use the most. And maybe you can have one folder on here, but I personally think that this looks awesome. So the reason you would want multiple apps is if you force press on one of these shortcuts, there's only four slots where you can have applications because the little widget panel is not large enough to support anything larger. So if you were to have two applications, then you could theoretically have eight slots. If you were to have four applications and that's 16 slots worth of applications that you can get inside of that little widget panel on your iPhone. So I really do hope you guys take advantage of this. All of this will be linked down below in the description. Make sure you check out that really cool series shortcut as well. And as always, peace.